Now, Seminole Hard Rock Hotel and Casino Tampa brings you 10 sports. Well, here's a sentence I never thought I would have to say to begin a sports cast, but I was reading an article of Vanity Fair today, and I found it very interesting. I found it um, interesting for the, for the article's sake. You know, the, the words, Koi, can we, can we change the picture? I don't think it's helping my cause. Okay, thank you so much. So I was reading the article of Vanity Fair, and it was a beautiful essay on Giselle's life in part, detailing her divorce with Tom Brady, how she's feeling, where she's at mentally, how she's reconciling with the split, how are the kids, the dating rumors. It's a lot. But, but right there in the middle of this long piece, there was a truth bomb that came out of nowhere. The interview took place a few days after the Bucks lost to Dallas in the playoffs. Giselle said she was still cheering for her ex-husband, adding this analysis about his final game and season in the NFL. Quote, it was tough, but you know what? Let's just be honest. It's a team sport, and you can't play alone. I think he did great under the circumstances that he had. I mean, he had no offensive line. Whoa! That is a flamethrower from nowhere. It's like in Little Nicky when Winkler gets covered with bees, but instead of Winkler, it's Donovan Smith and company. Look, Giselle isn't wrong. That is 100% true, which is why Jason Light has some serious questions to answer come draft day. We also want to know if Tristan Wirfs is going to be moving from right tackle to left tackle. Well, ever since we drafted Tristan, we've talked about that. So um, I think right now it's just talk, but we have the offseason. We still have you know, a lot of time here to see how this unfolds. 